namaskar um thank you so much to everybody for being here thank you nehru center thank you all the staff and the audiences and my dear artists via kala the arts a national portfolio organization in the region we live we are based in hampshire but we work in london as well um i'm sushmita pati the artistic director and um i'm just happy to be announcing this program today i'll keep it very short um i will call upon the deputy um, director of nehru center to come and light the lamp thank you so sanjay sharma ji is the deputy director so i will introduce the artists so we have yadavan a beautiful singer please on vocals we have rohan roy on violin we have suchismita ganguli mohini atam performer and we have a beautiful dancer kali chandrasekharam all the way from liverpool he has been working with the company for the last 12 years thank you so much We start today's program with Jagannath Swami, Nayana Pathagami Bhavatume. So we have a beautiful um, musician. So we're going to start that song, and I shall join them. So we are presenting a small shloka. Then we'll move on um, to Odissi style, and I will be performing a Pallavi. It's in recorded music, Vasant Pallavi, just to give you the technicalities of the piece. Then I shall be introducing my fellow artist. will be doing a mohini atom piece thank you so much
ಜಗನ್ನಾಥ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ನಯನ ಪಥಗಾಮೀತು ಮೇ ಜಗನ್ನಾಥ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ನಯನ ಪತಗಾಮೀತು ಮೇ ಜಗನ್ನಾಥ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ನಯ ಪಥಗಾಮೀತು ಮೇ ಜಗನ್ that was in rag rag jog one of my favorite ragas beautiful presented by my colleagues here we move on to um, pallavi in odissi it's a technical piece pallavi means to blossom how a flower blossoms from very small to something big in its own space without being forced to blossom so that's what you see in pallavi and that's why the item is called pallavi pallavi comes from the word pallava which means blossoming and it's based on raga basant and it's on recorded music presented by sushmita patti thank you ಸಾಧಿ 
On to the next dance is Mohini Atam by a beautiful dancer, uh, um, Suchismita Kanguli. She's going to say a few words. Shall I say? Okay. It's about three friends who are sakhis, they're playing. One of them is a little bit sad, so the two friends are cheering her up to play the ball. So this she's presenting as an Abhinaya piece in Mohini Atam style. Thank you so much. Ta 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 
you, Suchi Smita. That was beautiful. We have our next artist, Kali Chandrasekharam, a very experienced dancer in the UK, um, originally from Malaysia. Um, he will be presenting a creative dance piece um, using his creativity. So the theme is a creative exploration to find the beauty of move music through movements. So we have our artist, Rohan Roy, who is going to play Hansadwani Rag and then Desh. And they're going to explore the movements through the music. And he's also joined He's joined by Yadavan in vocals. Thank you so much.
Wonderful, Kali. That was amazing. It just took us to a different heights. We move on to the next program. It's Gahana Kusuma, which is written by the great poet Ravindranath Tagore. It's celebrating the various aspects of Krishna. The Sakhis are looking eagerly for Krishna. They can see Krishna in the plants. They can see Krishna on the trees. They can see Krishna in nature, on the skies. They remember his beautiful sounds. They're wondering where the sound is coming from, of this magnificent, beautiful, melodious. They're trying to reach Krishna. They're trying to find Krishna, remembering the smiles. And then saying, Sakhi, let's go and meet him. Where is he? So this is performed by Suchismita and myself and accompanied by Rohan. Thank you. Madhura Madhura Vanshi Vajay Vajay Sajaniya Vajay Madhura Vanshi Gahana Kusuma Gahana Kusuma Kunja Maje Gahana Kusuma Kunja Maje Mridula Madhura Vamshi Baja Visarita Saloka Laja Sajaniya Vavala Gahana Kusuma Kunja Maja
की शाम राय नए ने प्रेम उथल जाए So that was in two different styles. We've never worked together, so we tried to see how we can collaborate um, on stage. Um, we come to the last creative part of our performance today, which is Shapta. So this piece was created last year with three dancers in mind, which was Kali Chandrasekharam, Shomi Das, and myself. So I'm just going to talk a little bit about the piece because it's quite different aspects of the piece. It's about 15 minutes. So we have a musical part, then we have exploring various things. So music can uplift our moods and therefore it's healing. The musical notations take us through a journey, within that stirs, the invigorates the soul, through the chakras, up to Sahasra chakras or the crown chakra, the top of the head. So we will be showing that through the dance. The light from the sun deflects through the raindrops creates a spectrum of colors. The rainbows that reflects, which reflects the seven horses of the sun, Surya Dev, reigns in the Hindu mythology. The sun also has the rain on the seven classical planets. So we will be showing that through our dance. So today the journey begins with finding the essence of the unspoken knowledge of the notes in Indian Raga Kalyani. So we'll start the performance with Kalyani, where the dancer is presenting all the different notes through his movements, the alankars, the sargam, the song. In Indian classical song, apart from the words, the arrangements of each note in the scale gives the raga its unique quality and resonance. The transition movements, gamakas, between one note to another note is something we pay attention to and share in our beautiful creative dance. Then we build the relationship between the seven notes, ragas in Kalyani, to the sounds of different animals. So the different swaras here, they come from a different animal notes. So say for example, ni, nisha, uh, um, nisha comes from the elephant, re, rishab, bull, ga, gandhar comes from the goat, ma, madhyam, from the heron, dha, dhaivat, horse, ni, nisha, elephant, sa, sharaj, peacock. So the dancer is showing that through the movements, the artist is harnessing the energy of the notes, the animals, and bringing them together in the chakras to find a harmonious connection to the soul and the music. This leads us to, into the chakra section. The chakras are points in the body which energize and roots 